day 31 and it's yet another ridiculously beautiful morning look at the morning fog that's covering the landscape and the rays of sunshine cutting through the trees and the fog in this epic landscape I remember walking from Saria as being an ant procession full of people and now because I'm doing off stage Camino there's literally no one It's a completely different experience. No crowds, no loud chatter, just a quiet, beautiful morning. It's funny, it almost seems like it's an off-season Camino because even the cafes are closed it's just there's no one around and yet I'm in the busiest month I see no one and I see no coffee that's open it's just totally weird and funny Hey! Yeah, hey! Hey, friend! And then I stumbled upon this nice Dutch lady who made these little, I don't know what you call them, totems that you could pick. And mine said, obstacles don't block the path, they are the path. And uh, when I look at my Camino, that pretty much sums it up. Because a Camino, like life itself, is not a smooth, unobstructed road to glory, or whatever you want to call it. It's a constant set of challenges, 
a series of metaphorical mountains to climb. Also, some deep valleys to traverse. And to embrace the obstacles as the path itself is to recognize that struggle and growth are intertwined. It is the resistance that forges the resolve. It's the adversity that builds our armor of wisdom and resilience. So she definitely gave me the right saying that very much applies to my Camino and probably to many other things as well. What are you doing here? Why are you naked? Mes amours.